Good evening, everybody, and welcome to uh, this weekend UFL football. It is Saturday, and we are seeing the Warriors face off against the Mustangs at the game of the week, the Pulse game of the week. Sorry, I'm getting my brain together here. Um, my name's Tom Box. I'm going to be joined by Jefe El Nino McGee, and we've got Ryden on the on the stream machine. Appreciate you guys joining us. Thank you, Ryden, for streaming. And uh, I'm being told we're going to pause for a minute at 4 p.m. at the mark of 4 p.m. to respect the uh, the the things that are going over on in France. So I'm going to shut up here in just a second. And we'll have a moment of silence. All right, we're not going to take this moment to have a moment of silence for the tragedies happening in France. All right, guys, we'll start our minute of silence. down. The game is on. The kick is out. Uh, apologize about that. I was actually looking up something real quick, so I missed that. So, here we go. Nice little return by Kent there. <clears throat> Get him out to the 25. See if Blaze is going to look to run first. Um, this is going to be a good game, I think. The Warriors can definitely take this, in my opinion. Absolutely. It, it should be a very good game. Um, look forward to seeing both teams clash. Um, Down. I think I chose the Warriors as well. Blaze takes a snap, rolls to his left-hand side. He is going to run, as Hef said. Juice to the right, but is taken down. Yeah, that's just what you're going to see all game. I mean, if Blaze... Like, if, if Blaze is allowed to run, he's going to do it. Um... He's not going to risk a throw. He's going to use his feet because he's pretty good at it. You don't bottle, if they don't bottle him up in the front line, it's, we're just going to see that all game. 
down. Absolutely, there's a snap. Blaze rolls back, rolling forward. He's got kind of he's got blocked in, but he's gonna get out of the stumble, roll right, get past Humphreys there, and move up, get the first down, and then some. Pick up a seven Do yards, tackled by Smoke. Doing it all on his own again. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, if they if they continue uh, if they continue to you know to keep those open, you know he's gonna you know like he said he's gonna make the run all day long, and we both yep. know from personal experience that bound run. set hike. Hey, yep. Play takes a snap, roll into the left hand side. He's got two defenders coming in at him. He's dropping back now, looking for a pass. Brings him over. Veronica gets the block. Smoke is his only person in front of him. Smoke he's is rolling forward. Toss he's gonna he go. He's, oh, and he's gonna get Terrible finally decision. taken down. Yeah. That's that's a blaze the blaze call right there. He he wasn't looking down the field. He knew he had pressure. He decided to pull it down and run it. He had no business doing that. He got wide open on the left side of the field. That's the thing about Blaze. If you get pressure on him, he'll break it. He'll break down. It, he always he always does. So if if they can continue getting pressure, I mean, completely unblocked. I don't I don't know if V didn't get the play call or if she was that slow off her ball and didn't get out. But there were three people out there. Absolutely. Schmoke is the only one person in front of him now. Captain Humphreys and Gucci. There's the throw That's mid. Pick. Pick. Easy. Read that all the way. Like I said, this Warriors team played us a hell of a lot better, heck of a lot better <clears throat> than um, than the Mustangs did. We just played terribly against them, but the Warriors have been playing us the Warriors really well the last couple well. of the scrims. Yeah, the last couple of scrims we played them, they, they're, <laughs> they're doing Where's really well. Can we keep well. you a player? Change of possession. I don't think I've scrimmed them yet with the uh, <clears throat> with you guys with us. I don't think so, cause you know, cause y'all y'all been here for only two weeks. Yeah, and we didn't scrim them this week, cause we're taking the week off. And what did we do last week? Uh, only a couple scrims, if I remember. I think they I, can, I think I think they ended up either they canceled or we canceled for something last week. I don't remember the week that y'all joined. <clears throat> Gucci taking a lot of time here. Absolutely. Sure. Going going on. On. Balls in, well, the ball oh, the ball play. was in play. Yeah, yeah, I just saw that. Not sure what was going on there, but 32 yeah, seconds on the clock. There's a the snap roll into his left hand side. And touch the box. He's got a pretty good wall in front of him. Not much pressure. He's got a backside comeback if he wants There's it. There it yep. is. And Ricky Bobby with the catch so and the tackle. Yep, that's the exact play that Blaze had earlier and didn't take. But with a quarterback that can see the field, sees both sides left and right, no matter which way he's rolling, Gooch sees it and dumps it off. Yeah, it. Absolutely. Gooch takes a snap, rolling to his left-hand side. Coverage is pretty good. Oh, and I just had a screen pop up. Windows update. Thank you. There's a throw. And it's, Ooh, that was close. Yeah, this almost, Blaze almost snagged that one. No, nah, that was a, gonna... that was that was good placement. Right. Gucci put it where the only person that was gonna reach it was his receiver. Who, who's number four for them? Uh, oh, six. That's, so that's gonna be yeah. Sick, if yeah. it was anybody, it would have been sick. I don't think Blaze actually had a shot at that ball. It was a good placement by Gucci. Down, sick. Sorry, I'm having to get rid of the screen. <laughs> You're all good, bro. Windows just updated and deleted everything out. <laughs> Gucci rolls left on that play, and he's going to lose a few. Um, there just weren't any blocks initially. Um, so good uh, good job by the uh, front four from the Mustangs to force a force a momentum stop here. Second and long behind the It's not somewhere you want to be. Absolutely. Gucci takes a snap to the right. I think we're going to see that good bit this game, too. The, the, the back and forth on the sacks, dropping back, then a good pass. There's the pass to the middle. Got a receiver coming back. Caught. That was a good placement. Yeah, absolutely. He got it. That's one it, thing about Gucci, man. He understands the levels in the field what i mean by levels is there's certain quarterbacks in this league that know how to drop it underneath or over the top um call that getting leveled Down because it. sometimes it's just literally impossible to cover and that was a good good uh, example right there. snaps rolls right he's gonna cross the line of scrimmage make it a run he's gonna go up and run into a pile of players but not after picking up five yards tackle by kent Voss. Get a little run yeah i mean especially keep, you know, keep you're balanced, keep balanced yeah i mean you're, you're creeping up to the end zone all you need is five in and then a, a, a couple, you know, a little bit of change left, and you're in. 
Gooch lining up in, the, I believe that's the power formation. Staps rolls to the left-hand side. Veronica's on the outside. Leaves a lot on the open in the yeah, middle. Yeah, she left entirely. It's, that's one thing that V does consistently is she might hold the edge, but there's no she, – she never presses it back in. Like once she gets sets the edge, she never presses back in. She just keeps going out, and that just left a massive hole there for Gooch to take. Bounce it. There's a snap. Gucci's rolled to the right-hand side. Lots of blocks. Doesn't have anybody in front of him. I foresee a run. There's the run. Oh, he's going to stumble I in. Feet. I saw feet in the end zone. He stumbled in. If we're going to be consistent with our play calling, play even though I may not like it, if we're going to be consistent, that should be a touchdown because he definitely stumbled in. Yep, they're going to pause it and review it. Yeah, Personally, I feel like that's... That's, that's putting too much on the referee's plates. I feel like we should just kind of play, the, unless it's just, you know, obviously the field messing up. Uh, but, yeah, that's that's a lot for them to have to kind of look at. So we'll see what they do with it. If we keep it consistent, that should be a touchdown, I think, by what I saw. Absolutely. <clears throat> Whoa, my voice cracked there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I remember when puberty hit. <laughs> <laughs> so as we take this, we're going to take a moment to let you guys know in Hitbox World and on the field. I think you guys all know this on the fan sim. Everybody knows it, but this game is brought to you by Blueberry. And as we wait for them to check, take a look around Probably. here. So it looks like yeah, I can't tell exactly what they're doing. I wish we could do. Okay, so they are oh, going to give him the touchdown. There it is. Yep. So that's going to be an early score. Warriors up six pending point after seven zero. As I said, I do think the Warriors can very easily take this game. And I, some people, for some reason, would consider this a shock. Um, but to me, it, this if the Warriors do win, is not a shock at all. I do think that they're a much better team all around. <laughs> And yeah, Damn. and the voting I believe at the uh, at the show was, um, I believe it was Spike and I chose the Warriors, and I think Matt chose the uh, Mustangs. So it's good. We shall see on, who Matt. gets the win there. I'm in last place on the pick, so you know. <laughs> well, good old Tom Box. Sounds like your uh, your fantasy too, dude. Just a series yeah. of unfortunate events, dude. You and Crack. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, I had some, I had some really good picks and players, and everybody's Dude, just I did, getting yeah. freaking hurt. Everybody's getting. Broken. Meanwhile, I got Andrew Luck just, <laughs> just, just chilling, not doing anything. It's great. I I completely forgot to look at it this uh, this weekend and set players. Probably still have time. Well, there you go. Yeah, it's, I mean, probably for mo the most part. Uh, I got a phone call. Hold on, it's all you, Tom. All right. Down. Oh, and it showed an interception. Field having its typical glitches on us. Blazer on ah, lining up in the trips left formation. Rolls to his left hand side. He's got a lot of room on the left hand side. He's gonna go across the line of scrimmage, move up, get around Dana with some nice footwork. He's gonna go to the inside, then come back to the outside. Finally gets tackled down by Ricky, but not before picking up a solid fifteen yards. So a solid run there on on that first opening play. Down. Blaze rolls out to the I'm right hand side, back. makes a pass, and passes incomplete. So, someone on the uh, chat yep. would like to say that they love the biased opinion. Well, the, the point of an opinion is that it's an opinion. Um,. So we're going to go ahead and stop that conversation there. You can go ahead and let me know when you figure out the definition, bro. Down. <laughs> There's a snap rolling to the right-hand side. Captain America's on the right on the right on the containment, but Staples can't get the block down, and it's there taken goes down. Pressure in his face, like I said. 
He had to yeah. go on the backside again. He had to throw it over the edge of a the cornerback. Actually, was completely out of position. He could have just thrown it over the, over his back shoulder, and it would have been money. But didn't see it. I think Blaze was just more watching uh, Darian Humphreys there on the outside, waiting for. Yeah, uh, like I said, like that. That's what I'm saying. Down, you set, get hike. pressure in Blaze's face. You point Absolutely. the game. Absolutely. Snap left rolls. Continue rolling left. Gucci coming down, and there Darian Humphreys again. again with the sack. Oh man, two First in a row. That's huge. And loss of 14 yards, driving the sticks. Almost back to the 20 yard line. And there's the punt formation. Down, set, hike. There's the punt going straight in the middle to the right of Tad. There's the grab, dead middle. Gucci with a return, rolling left, rolling right, juking around, trying to get around uh, Drake Courts there. He's going to go all the way back cross field, goes up, tries to get out some more. Got some blocks. Veronica there on the run. God, Gucci's Can't making them look him. silly. That's some nice blocking downfield, but Gooch made. I didn't know see who it was. Was it? I don't know if it was Dre, but he made somebody look absolutely silly just now. <laughs> I, I, I missed it because I was like a really bad camera angle, but that was a nice little move. Oh, There's a snap rolling to the left hand side. Got some containment. Staples is the only one right there. Staples gets a block. Look at that pass. Wow, pass that was sick, beautiful pass. Perfect placement again. He just threw it somewhere where Marlowe had no chance at it. Sick was the only one with a chance at it, and he went yeah, out and got down it. With it. It's one that I mean that you can say anything you want about Gucci, like, but I've played with him obviously on the the original Raiders, um, <laughs> and dude knows how to throw the ball in levels. There's nothing Absolutely. more to be said about it. Snaps right. Oh, Mikey Turbo comes in on the backside and takes down Gucci with a sack, loss of ten yards. I've I I feel like this is going to be a rather high sack game. Yeah. I think we're going to see that on both sides. Gucci takes a snap. Rolling to his left-hand side. He's got Veronica on the outside. K coming in on the middle. Staples on the backside. Rolling back. Dropping back. Moving back around. He is in tight containment there. Dropping far back. He's at the 20-yard line. Rolls up. There's a throw on the comeback route left side. Another level. And another threw it underneath. Pass. Yeah, just threw exactly where he needed to. I mean, that that's, that is what gives you the definition of of a really good quarterback is when he can throw to his receiver to where nobody else can grab it. Because there was no chance for that cornerback to, to jump down and get that and get that ball. Gooch snaps, roll to the right yeah, hand side. Exactly. He's looking around. He's going to go ahead and make the run across the line. Nice of move. to the first down. Absolutely. Dexter, he gets around, but is finally tackled. And yeah, that was that was turbo. easy. Needed one block, picked it up, took it upfield. Got to have more pressure. They're there every once in a while. The thing about the Mustangs is it just not hasn't been consistent yet this game. They got to get that defense consistent. Absolutely. There's a snap rolling left. Ron is coming down. Staples coming down. He's going to shoot up. Oh, he's going to dance around, but finally get sacked and get taken nice down by Veronica. Yeah. Loss of seven yards. She did a good job coming in on the backside there. See, she actually pressed in. You know, Absolutely. sometimes, like I said, she didn't do that on that one play at the goal line. She did it right there. Gets her a sack. Well done. Two snaps. Dropping back. Staples on his right hand side. Veronica's coming straight in. There's a throw to the right hand side. Ooh, and just over. Over Isles. Yep. I think maybe he thought Isles was going to keep going up. But I think that was actually a good decision by Offs because he did have that safety over the top. Um, is that Ken? Yeah, Ken. He had Ken over the top of him, so I think that was actually a bad, poor decision by Gucci there. But it's going to happen. Snap. Oh, yeah, absolutely. There's snap. Roll to the left-hand side. He's got a block on the outside. He's going to oh, go across the v. line of scrimmage and dance around Staples, but Staples is not going to have any of it and go ahead and tackle him, but not before picking up a good five yards. He ran Bringing the V right back. into that block. <laughs> and here comes a field goal formation from at the 33 yard line so shouldn't be too ter too too hard whatsoever to make and a great decision to kick a field goal to get points on the board i think this is going to be this is definitely definitely a, a solid decision uh to, to go for this field goal eight seconds left on the play clock down there's the kick it's up 
Oh, and it falls short of the uprights. Didn't have enough power. So it's going to be a turnover Dang. on downs. No good. Interesting decision there. For the I mean, I would have gone for the points too, but you got to you got to make that. It's only 33 yards. Yeah, that's true. I too. mean, that's not far. You just got to get 100% and you can make it in. So the Bull uh, Bulldogs correction, the Mustangs going to come out and take over Bulldogs are next game. Lining up in the trips left formation, Dexter, Dre Courts, and Staples on the left hand side, Marlowe and Ken on the right. Down. Blaze rolls out to He's the left. He's got a backside comeback if he wants it, doesn't see nope, it. Nope, Again. Doesn't, gets tackled. I think he had already dedicated to the run. That's yeah, he's going to. I mean, if he sees even a slight hole, he's going to panic and go. That's that's just what he does. And the Warriors are doing a good job keeping him bottled up. Very good job so far. Absolutely. You open a hole and then he starts going through it and then you close down that hole and that's down. Uh, and that, that that ends it. Blaze takes a snap, rolls to his right-hand side. Darian is the only one right there coming at him. We got Gucci on the back. He's going to drop flat. far back. He's going to oh. go and throw it out. He had a middle flat. Right across the seam, someone was streaking across from left to right. It was there, but unfortunately, Blaze unable to see it. Does a good job this time, though, to actually get the ball out, and uh, he doesn't take a sack, so that, that's good for the Mustangs. Trips right formation with Kent Voss on the outside. Dre and Staples lined up on the right as well. Down, set, hike. There's a snap dropping to the right. Wow, quickly right through Darian. Off by Darian. Quickly blocked off, but Darian Got right around V. Absolutely. She finally picks him up later, but it ruined There's that play from the get. There's a pass back. Oh, almost great. Yeah, it ruined that play from the get-go. And even though V was able to come off the backside to pick it up, I mean, she completely left the left side of the field open. Blaze is forced to throw a bad pass. Can't do that when you're playing on the line. Go to the other side like that. You absolutely. Gotta, so you got to keep it. You got to keep your yeah. side. As quick as the Mustangs got the ball, we're at a fourth and eight situation at the 35. They are going to go for it. So this could be a good turn of events if the Warriors are able to prevent this from happening. Down. There's a snap. Blaze rolls to his right-hand side. Darian's coming out, trying to get around Cat. It's got the sideline if he wants way it. Way back. There's a throw up, and it's caught. Called by Staples. Staples only has one person to get around. And that's going to be the biggest thing is if Blaze can keep getting the ball in Staples' hand, Warriors are going to have a really hard time uh, defensively. They've done a good job in not allowing him to make a catch right now, but if he does catch the ball, he knows how to move a little bit after the play. After the catch, rather. Down. Absolutely. Blaze takes a snap, rolling to his left-hand side. He's got Gooch coming on his out, smoke in the middle. Darian locked up in blocks. Blaze continues to roll to the right-hand side. He's got to come back route. But that comeback throw that. go back up. There's a throw to the middle, and it's missed. Completely missed. 420. <clears throat> uh, I'm slightly ahead of you, sir. No, it's 728 <laughs> left on the clock. No, no, the time. I know, Bear I, know. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> Blaze takes a snap, rolls. Oh, Gooch gets right around for Oh, there's the final block. Blazes rolling yeah, she picked it up he's too late, though. Short. He's, he's, yeah. And he, he, had a, he had a quick out, actually. He had a quick out. The corner was beat. Sit got beat there off the start. He had it, but he couldn't make the throw because he missed that initial block, unfortunately. She does pick it up, and they do get positive yards, which is good. So, nice job to move the sticks, but that may have been a touchdown. Down, set, hike. Blaze lining up. Trips right. Snap. Rolling right. Rolling. Oh, rolls. He... He goes he back into to the that left, one. right into Schmoke, and gets yeah. a sack and lost for four. You can tell he's already distrusting his line. He didn't wait for the block there, didn't think it was going to happen, tried to force it up sooner than he should have, and he paid for it. Down. 640 left in the game, or left in the game, wow, left in the first quarter. He takes a snap, roll to the left-hand side. He is dropping back further. Dana, oh, almost on him, throw into the middle, into a bunch. It's just a Pick, chuck up. Picked by Sire Nabalo. Yeah, when a team has to go to the chuck up, that's never a good sign when you have to start Absolutely. doing that. If you're not making good, concise, you know, passes, you're just chucking it up and hoping for the best. That's never a good spot to be in as an offense. Yep. So the Warriors prevent the Mustangs that's from it. getting six points on the board, but they could get a, a sack here and only get two. Hand art, uh, not handoff, but a roll out to the right, dropping back, looking around, doesn't find anything, gets right stumbled. Is left. Yeah. Well, I had my camera turned around because. <laughs> 
if I don't, my my camera's like in the uh, in the scoreboard or in the uh, the 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 uprights. There we go. Words are hard. Down set. There's a snap. Fake handoff. Rolling right. He's got some blocks. He's looking. Oh, Dexter's right there. Unblocked. There we go. Nice some move. Footwork. Absolutely. Veronica with the tackle. Pickup of 11 yards and a first Oof. down. Yeah, Dex did a good job in stepping up. and because As a cornerback, you never want to have to abandon coverage, but he did a good job in abandoning thing there to step up and make Gooch have to make a move, but there wasn't anybody off the line to give any help. So Gooch sick. is going to win that one-on-one -on -one most, you know, nine times out of ten. There's a snap rolling to the left-hand side. He's got a guy middle. Looking around. Deep middle. He's nope, still looking. It. There's the pass. Oh, and it was caught well, That's going to be an interception. Yep. Ooh, that's a tough one. She was blocked, too. That's really unfortunate. <laughs> he threw it into a block player. Really, really unfortunate. This could be huge for the Mustangs right here. Nice play. Who was that? Staple. Uh, Dana. Huh? Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Staple yeah, it was Staples. Was okay, yeah. That was a nice adjustment there at the last second, though. He kind of, like, you could tell he pulled off the stretch to get in the way of the ball, and he's rewarded with a uh, with a pick there. Good job, Stapes. Oh, there we go. I turned advanced lighting model off. Hello. Down, man. set, high. Blaze takes a snap, rolling to his left-hand side. Veronica with the block on Gooch gives Blaze a little bit more time. Rolling left, dropping back. Rolling right. Looking for a man on the end zone. And finally gets tackled. The coverage back in the end zone was just phenomenal. And you had, I, I, you know, you looked up and you see, you know, you see a couple Mustangs just standing still, which is allows, which allows coverage to be pretty easy on that. But Blaze has a little bit more room to work with, so I know some quarterbacks actually prefer to go a little yeah, further Cam, back. Yeah, Cam doesn't mind taking a sack every once in a while. He sometimes does it on purpose. So. Yep, Darian is right there, but Blaze is going to try and go up. But Dana cuts him off. Fantastic move. Blaze is going to go ahead and cut up. Has a good move Dick. by Blaze. Jeez. Absolutely sick. Trying to chase him down, but Blaze is taking the angle, but finally catches him and takes him down. Pick up of nine. No blocks to be had. He just wiggled out and really did the blocking for his line by running the defenders into them. That was... Some really good movement there by Blaze. Down. Blaze taking the snap, rolling to his right hand side. Darian on the out to block him to keep going further. Blaze turns back left. He's looking. The rest of the oh, there's a pass to the corner of caught by Kent. That was not there he goes. He finally see he looked to that back side there. He looked to the back side, saw the defense. That's all he has to do. He rolled left, saw the back side, the the corner was slacking off and he made him pay for it. That was a good that was a good job by by Blaze to see that. Nicely done. Absolutely. And a great pass and a and a great route getting open there on the on that back corner. That uh that Bounce, the, the, the uh, quarterback of the safety whoever was covering decided he was rolling with the quarterback instead of uh instead of staying with his man. And that cost their team uh, seven points against them. So that's going to bring the score tied. Warriors seven, Mustangs seven, with uh, four minutes and seven seconds left in the half. Blaze lining up to kick. Yeah, Blaze to kick, and Gooch back deep. See if Blaze decides to kick it to him. I wouldn't. Um, personally, don't want to give someone like uh, Gooch the ball in space. I'd kick it to you know one of the side guys. But he's oh, yeah. lining up straight on at the moment, so we'll see. Down, set, hike. When I was kicking for the Cowboys, I never kicked Gooch to their best guy in the back. <laughs> Just... Yeah. Uh, Gooch tried to grab it, but Ios with the uh, with the return, bring it up. He's at the twenty, coming up to the twenty five. We're gonna run into basically a wall of Mustangs there, mm, just yeah. the uh, inside or outside <laughs> of the hash there. Interesting decision to take it left. He had a few blockers on his right. I don't know what he was. I think maybe he thought he could juke that person because if he gets by that wall, then there wasn't anybody there. I'll give him that. But absolutely, that was, uh, that, was, that was a good job on the backside from the Mustangs to keep in their lanes, and they didn't give him that. Yep, and uh, a tough, a, a tough, you know, turnover there with the interception from the Warriors yeah. pretty much kind of gave the field to the Mustangs uh, to yeah. result in a touchdown. So Gooch rolls left, rolls right. He's got plenty of time in the backfield. Mikey coming out, got to come back another level. Left side. Yep, 
Marlo's got to stay closer to that. If she gives that outside, but, and that and that's one unfortunate thing that Marlo does happen to do quite a bit. Um, when we played against them, she does give the edge up a lot. And if if she keeps giving the edge to Sick, he's going to keep taking it, and Gucci's going to keep throwing it. So she's got to make sure she keeps that outside uh, that outside uh, containment there uh, to force him to throw it back into the middle of the defense. Strips right formation. Ricky Bobby, I also and Lido on the right Bounce. side. Darian and Sick on the left. There's a snap rolling to the right hand side. Plenty of blocks, but Gooch is going to have to do a little bit of footwork. He's got a lot of green open, and he's going to yeah, go he's going to take, take it. Up. Extra comes down from the CP position to get the tackle. Yeah, good step up by Dex to save what could have been potentially 15, 20 yards. But uh, yep. yeah, that uh, the uh, the defensive line of the Mustangs is still just not consistent with it. working together as a unit. It's costing them right now. Absolutely. Gooch runs. There's the throw. He's got guy a guy open middle. deep middle. It's gonna be Blaze between Blaze and Ricky Oof. Bobby, but uh, yeah, he like should have. He, yeah, I think I think I think he was trying to throw that more right and accidentally ended up putting it more deep than right. That gave Blaze a shot at it. He would have put it a little bit further to the right. I don't think that Kent saw that over the backside, and he may have had him a free touchdown. But regardless, it's gonna fall incomplete. Nice look though. Nice look. Down sir. Now. Rolls right, rolls left. Looking around, got plenty of time. Looks like the, the Mustangs are kind of staying and hovering around the line of scrimmage. He's going to go ahead and take the run and get plenty of yardage. He's and first. And going to pick up 16 yards on that run. So that would be yeah, the first Yeah, if I'm down. Gooch, I'm just going to start looking run like this. The the front four for the Mustangs are pretty much non-existent. When it, they're just getting blocked. Like, they're not. That was I would just it. be taking it. He's, he's gushing them, or gashing them, excuse me, right now. Absolutely, yep. And Gooch rolls right, back left, back to the middle. He's got to throw back side. Oh, he's got it in the corner. Sick. Caught. Boom. And tackled by Blaze. But what a beautiful catch. Yeah, and we Blaze, had a – Blaze saving the touchdown. Yeah, breakdown in communication between the corner and uh, between Marlo and Blaze there. Blaze was rolling off to the middle, probably maybe just didn't call it or Marlo didn't hear it, that he was abandoning the side. Gets beat over the top. His communication is key in this game. You got to talk, especially defensively. Down There's a snap, and it's a handoff rolling left, and ooh, it's extremely close. I did not have the camera uh, line up. The camera I didn't position either. To actually see that I one. didn't it, see. Yeah, if you got in or not. I was too far back. My camera was on Gooch, and I didn't catch yeah. the. Uh, I didn't catch it in time. <laughs> yeah. I have a only one free hand at the moment. We're uh, currently hear, playing with I my lighter. Bolt, I hear a playing bolt clinking. Oh, that's a lighter. Yeah, okay. It's my lighter. Sorry. <laughs> Speaking of, I didn't eat or dinner. I'm going to have to do that during halftime. I'm out. Phew. That looks like they're going to take a look at it on stream or yep, on. There's the timeout. If they're, if any of them are recording, I'm not sure. Mustangs call it timeout. Thank you, Ryden. So it is a timeout for the Mustangs, which is interesting. Wouldn't have done it this early. I would have waited until they went down to them, and it didn't look like the Warriors were going to be milking any clock. They didn't seem to have right. that inclination up to this point, but regardless, they're going to save themselves some time here. <laughs> sure, Tegan, you can have some leftover spaghetti. How about that. The ball is in play. Yeah, it's a Zippo Billy. <laughs> Gooch is Damn. lined up, takes a snap, rolls right, fake handoff. Oh, oh that's there's a lot of, so that's a much lot room. Of green. Dex is the only one that can Good stop Good job him. by Dex. Throw it, or throws it. He goes to throw it away. but That Dex, was a uh, touchdown saving step up by Absolutely. Dex. He's been, he's been pretty solid on that side of the field for the Mustangs so far. He's stepped up and saved them at least 35 yards in total running. By Gooch, and he just, and saved, he just saved that touchdown. Yeah, yep. absolutely. Gooch had there was so <laughs> there was room match. for days, and he made him pull back through there. Yeah, horizontally. Down really good job by There's Dex. A snap, handoff up the middle, touchdown. Touchdown should be a touchdown because he went yeah. right in. The play is under review. Down 58 seconds ago, there's a snap rolling to his left-hand side. 
Oh, he's gonna have to drop. Wow, back. he got away from that. Oh my gosh, and then he overthrew it. Oof. Oh, Gucci, Gucci, Gucci. He did an amazing job of avoiding like three people directly in his face. And unfortunately, yeah. overthrow sick in the corner of the end zone. But this is giving their defense ridiculously good positioning. And the Mustangs have to be worried. As many times as Blaze has already been sacked, um, yep. this is bad territory to be in with 43 seconds left in the half. Down. There's a snap. Blaze rolls left and rolls right. He's got Humphreys straight on him and throws it away. Yep, just gets rid of it. He knew that he had nowhere to go with that. I'd have to log out and log back in, change viewers. Firestorm is just not cutting it with the settings that I've got right now. I'm lagging too much. Struggling, Tom, dude. Well, just I... Just driving the struggle bus, dog. I use this viewer for regular SL. I don't have it <laughs> tweaked for uh, for football. Yeah, I just... Alchemy is my tweaked one. This one, yeah, has all, like, this one has all the graphics turned up and Down. pretty. Yep. Play snaps, rolls left. A good block there on the outside. Continue rolling left. Smoke. There's the pass. I didn't see it leave his hand at all. Oh, it's picked. Pick. Yeah, I never saw that ball leave his hand, so I didn't know where it went. I just saw the pick. <laughs> yeah. So 28 seconds to go for the Warriors to get uh, to get up about 30, and all 36 three yards, 37 yards. Yep. Plenty of time with the way SL works. They can easily score. Um, they've got plenty of time to do this, so. They should oh, don't I've, need seen, to I've, seen, I've seen quarterbacks scoring less than that. There's a snap oh, yeah. right. Gonna He's have got the sideline up. He wants oh, it. The one on one. Gonna take it. He's go throws cross. Oh, he throws the level. He throws back. the level. Good, Good choice. choice. Pass. Eighteen seconds to go. Yeah, and the play was Marlo stopped. kept There's the outside the there. Uh, really good job, but uh, sick able to find or Gooch, excuse me, able to find the level, chucked it underneath where she still that couldn't get to it. And um, but you see the difference between when he catches it on the inside of the field and instantly is tackled as opposed to running into the end zone. Um, so that that was a good job by Marlo to keep him bottled up yeah, in the sure. field. For sure. Who takes the snap, rolls to the right hand side, staples on that outside to He's block got the him. corner. There's the pass. Picked off by Kent. Picked Ross off. In the oh, end he zone. missed it. That was, should have. That sh mm. Mm, that's a tough ugh. break for Gooch. Mm. As Ricky Eights. Bobby, unfortunately, he kind of he over he overran the ball. What happened? He uh, Gooch threw it back to his right to threw it to kind of you know get it a better angle and uh ricky just unfortunately misjudged it ran past it and uh the mustang's gonna be the benefactors this game is gonna come down to i i feel like this game is gonna come down to one score it could come yeah. down to a uh to a field goal oh yeah with the the back and forth and the answer or a missed each. one yep or a missed or a missed goal. one yep. welcome to the nfl boys the missed pats are real Maybe we'll see an overtime. We haven't seen a, an overtime Down, game set, in, the high. Of, uh, in the history of uh, the UFL. Blaze snaps, rolls to the right-hand side. He's got plenty of time on the left looking for a receiver. They're all bunched up. He's got one lone man on the right side caught by Dre. Caught. He's going to roll left, but he is tackled. And that is yeah. halftime, ladies and gentlemen. Going to talk half about time. a couple sponsors see, real fast. So get room. them up. Well, while you're pulling them up, that was a pretty good half. Uh, went about as expected for the most part, but I do think that um, the Mustang, I mean, excuse me, the Warriors are going to come out here probably in the second half, and they might be able to uh, get some more consistency going. Um, but good job to the Mustang so far in, in staying in this game. They didn't let that early score bother them, and, and they're still obviously right in this game. 7-7 seven, seven. is a good one so far. Absolutely. Fantastic game. So let's talk about some sponsors here. Blueberry. Blueberry is an original clothing store for women made by a woman with passion for art. Simply Epic, your one-stop shop for all your sports fan gear. Be it football, baseball, basketball, or hockey, we have your team. Jerseys, hoodies, gotchas, and more. Don't see your favorite college, favorite player or college team? Contact Sarah Nabalo or Nakari Tolson, and they'll get you hooked up in Simply Epic fashion. It's girls and fellas. Need to surprise your friend with a res day gift? Need something extra to make your proposal extra special? Or are you opening your own club or mall? Maybe you just want to entertain or have some fun. Then why not hire the It's Girls and Fellas, a professional dance troupe that always has fresh ideas for that perfect moment and regular off-Broadway shows at our beautiful theater in Second Life. Contact Winston Charming or Carabella, Carabella Valise for details. And we'll just stop right there and head over to the Mustang Darlings. They're going to be the only cheer squad out tonight. And uh, let's head over to them. I'm going No. 
new Cupid. Mm -hmm. Make a Tennessee River Hey everybody I think the time is right Let's get together Down where the catfish bite Alrighty, and a great performance by the 
Mustang Darlings. And we're going to go ahead and talk about a couple more sponsors before we get this game back under go under wrap or uh back playing words they just don't work glamorous glamorous was first established in december of 2013 and had its relaunch in april of 2014 bringing poses from couples adult friends kids family singles gotchas props and much more rain shoes 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 rain is the go-to store of a woman with many styles we have a variety of shoes and accessories to fit any occasion we strive to make sure that everyone can find something that suits them B-Fly Tattoos. B-Fly Tattoos has been creating in Second Life for over five years and is well known for their quality of work and customer service. With over 200 tattoos in store for both men and women and custom tattoos made to order, we're sure to find that a design that suits your style. All tattoos come with the latest suppliers for mesh bodies for both men and women, come in two tones and have a vast range from the very delicate to the over-the-top full body designs, from abstract to oriental, from old school to new school, or custom made. B-Fly Tattoos have you inked. Femesht. Femesht is a monthly event that opens on the first of every month. Each month, we provide top quality original mesh designers to help fill your needs for fashion and home garden designers. We aim to provide the best of the best for the shoppers of Second Life. And ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be your halftime advertisement, your halftime performance. I believe the teams are already coming out. Nope, they're not. I just started seeing the notifications. I am going to take a quick moment to uh, change viewers so I don't keep getting bad frame rate drops. Uh, so Hef has it for just a moment. I'll be back. No, I don't. Okay, well, no, he doesn't, but I'll be back. In <laughs> so, yeah, good game so far. Be interesting to see what I want to see from both teams. So let's talk about what does Hef want to see from both teams. So from both teams. So if we're looking at the Mustang side, their defensive line has to get some pressure. When they get pressure in Gucci's face, they've shown that they can force him to make bad passes and that they can force sacks. They've done both when they get pressure. But that defensive line has not been consistent. And because they haven't been consistent, Gooch has been able to level off their secondary. He's able to find open people after the initial three or four seconds of a play. The plays are going too long offensively for the Warriors, and the Mustangs have to put a stop to that. If they can do that, they can easily take this game. Um, for the Warriors, uh, as far as the Warriors are concerned, they're— Basically, on defense, they've got to continue getting in Blaze's face. It's working. They need to keep getting in his face. They need to keep forcing sacks and keep making him throw it away. When he's able to move around and he's able to make plays with his feet, he's obviously one of the better quarterbacks in the league. So you keep him from doing that. You bottle him up. You negate his ability to just make everybody miss for four or five seconds and wait for someone to get open. The routes from the Mustangs need to get better. Right now, they're terrible. Too many times they have four or five guys just streaking up the field. No idea that they could come back and help Blaze out. If they can get those two things taken care of, if What's they can get blocks and their routes can tighten up, get a little bit quicker and get them some five, six-yard dumps instead of you know trying to get the 20, 30-yard bomb. They don't need a 20, 30-yard bomb. It's a 7-7 seven, seven game. You need one touchdown, and you need to kill the clock. You need to run Tom Brady offense right now is what you need to do. Um, so that's what I want to see uh, from um, – uh, from uh, excellent the, reference the Mustangs to the offensive. Tom Brady offense. Excellent, yeah, like excellent that, that is, yeah, that is what Blaze needs to do right now. Like he needs to take it, either of these quarterbacks. Honestly, they're both in the same exact situation. They need Gooch just needs to keep doing what he's doing. Gooch is doing a phenomenal job leveling the defense and just getting the ball out there. If Blaze can do the same thing, it's going to be a really, really tight game because so far he hasn't been allowed to do that. It's just been the one chuck up that he got. If Blaze can move, if he's allowed to just move the ball Bounce, slowly down the field, he's going to score. So I would love to see I would love to see that 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 uh that beautiful offense that perfection that is the Patriots offense uh, continue to to show out for these teams here. <laughs> <clears throat> that may have been a little biased. I'll, I'll go ahead and admit. So uh, that was a nice little kick, good little return there. Nice field nice. position for the Warriors. So Gooch is going to take over. Actually, going to start with the two uh, running back set. It's going to be interesting to see if he likes to run the misdirection. That's been a huge thing this season. That's going to be. I'm going to go ahead and give a little shout out to the Titans right here. They're the ones that kind of show that hey, misdirections are going to work in this league with the way that the ball works. Didn't go with it this play, but maybe we'll see him do that now. Gooch does a really good job in avoiding so many people. The Mustangs had some nice pressure there, but he was able. That was only. That's the thing. They they they're there, and it's always one person. 
it's always one person are not moving as a as a unit as i said earlier on the defensive line you really have to move as a as four and just you know choke a quarterback out a quarterback that's very good on the, on his that's feet uh, you have to choke them out slowly and so far that's not happening staples with good pressure off the edge this time stays unblocked good job by him gooch can't get the edge really nice job by staples and the front the other three of the mustangs did a really good job and not letting him go anywhere and that's exactly what you have to do right there they bottled him up Staples kept the edge. The other three moved in slowly with him, remaining unblocked. Gooch had nowhere to go, couldn't find a receiver, and it yields them a sack. That was exactly what the Mustangs have to do every single play if they want to get if they want to take over this game. Third and long is not somewhere where the Warriors are going to want to be right now. Say that again. Yeah. So. Yeah. So here goes uh, Gooch. He's going to take this snap. Rolls left. Terrible route so far. Nobody really cutting anywhere. He's got an out route, but he's already abandoned the left side. He's back on the right. He's all alone. He finds Darian in the middle of the field. A nice little job to just kind of keep moving, keep steady. Darian's able to find a nice uh, little hole there between Blaze and, and Marlow. Not that it was bad coverage. It's it's just a little hole that that you know naturally opens up in the field. It happens in the NFL. It's going to happen in Second Life as well. And uh, good job by Gucci to find it. Dumps it off. That's it. First down. Takes this snap, rolls right. He's looking for maybe uh, his guy on the edge here. No, he's just going to run this one. He had a couple blockers. Unfortunately, they weren't able to get anything going for him. And is that Cat? Yes, Cat able to – she did a really good job scraping down the line. It's called a scrape when you see one of the linemen pretty much just going straight down the line of scrimmage and make that tackle right there. She did a good job That's scraping it. from the backside and uh, getting that tackle to stop uh, for a very short gain. Gooch takes this one. He's going to roll left, trying to get some blocks. He's definitely looking run first, I'm sure, right now. He's got a guy in the middle if he wants it. He's also got space to run. Cuts back, holds it. He's got a lot of green now. He's got one-on-one -on -one with Dre. He's probably going to win this. And no, Dre does a good job in keeping up there. Good job by Dre to hold. And that allows Staples to come up from the backside on a really nice pursuit angle and uh, gets the tackle uh, to stop that one for going much longer than I thought actually it was going to. Um, so good job there, but it's still, unfortunately for the Mustangs, going to be another first down for the Warriors. Down back as soon as my viewer decides to, uh, not be frozen, because I was just went into preferences to make sure all my Don't stuff worry, was saved. Well, Gooch takes this one, rolls left, makes a V just completely whiff on the side, and he does the same to Marlow, and I think Blaze got blocked. He just made... Two people, arguably three, miss and took the ball by himself up the sideline. Wonderful, wonderful play by Gucci right there. Um, unfortunate for the Mustangs. They had the positioning. They were there, but again, it was one at a time Down. on the line. V stepped up um, to try to force him back and ran herself into the block. Gooch is able to just swing right by after that and just took it up the sideline, and that, that's all there was to it. Nice play. Nice run by Gooch. Good vision to take it there. That is the that is the offensive drive that the Warriors needed to bring up. Yep. So now if the Warriors can if the Warriors can stop the, the Mustangs, I believe the Warriors are going to come out, have come out with a different mindset now. I think we're going to see a little bit more of aggression from them, and the Mustangs are just going to have to step up. And answer back on this. Uh, answer back with this touchdown. Welcome back, Senior Box. Thank you. My Windows update changed to all of my settings. Down. As I use my Patriot zip lighter. There you go. There's the kick. It's deep. Kent Voss is going to be received. Blaze is way back there. Blaze, yeah. I think maybe he was, was just guarding in case it did one of those crazy bounces, which actually is kind of a smart idea. Yeah. Uh, Kent takes a nice little run up there on the sideline, though. Nice field position to start from. Absolutely. 29 yard line. Pick up of 18 there on the on the catch. Right now, Blaze is going to have to just channel his inner Brady. Right now, he's going to have to take over. He's going to have to he's going to have to carry this team down the field. It, it, there's down. there's no there's nothing else about it. That's what he's going to have to do right now. I believe Absolutely. he's a so huge Brady fan. Left -hand side. Smoke on his backhand side. <laughs> he's going to get the run and get tackled there by uh, by Lido. I believe Lido's the cornerback. Yeah, a nice run, though, by Blaze. Good job. That's what he needs to do. He needs to get established on the run. He needs to get the Warriors moving up. He needs to get them thinking run first, run first. And then he needs to get someone open for a quick hit.
It, it really Down. is, Billy. That's one reason that Blaze is so good, in my opinion. There's a snap. Roll into the right-hand side. He's got plenty of blockers in front of him. He drops way back. There's a throw to the middle. Nice level. Short pass to, to Dre. Rolling right. What I say? Get a, a quick good hit. Little juke. It's all he has to. This is all he has to do. The rest of the game. He does this the rest of the game. I think he wins this game. We'll see if he can keep doing it. That was perfectly executed. He didn't chuck it deep. He found somebody underneath. Used his feet to stay alive, it, relatively inside the pocket a little bit, and just found somebody over the middle. Very, very nice play by the Mustangs. Down, really set, wasn't talking in local. Blaze takes a snap, rolling to his left side. Lido's coming in quick, but he gets around Smoke. Uh, he's got a lot of green in front of him, but Smoke comes in. He stumbles. Oh, he stayed alive forever. Gets tackled. Yeah, not a terrible, terrible choice to run there. There wasn't much open down the field, but I feel like maybe he did force the run a little soon. I think he could have stayed back a little bit and danced a little bit more in the backfield, maybe try to get somebody open. But that's, I mean, it's hindsight. Rel I mean, that's still not a bad play at all. He'll be happy with that run. Down. He just wants to keep the defense pressing up into him. And Darian almost inside immediately. The blaze rolls to the left. He's dropping back. There's a, sh there's a pass into a lot of oh. coverage, and it's going to be picked off. Right. Yeah. Mm. This is uh, unfortunately this is exactly Dex what the ran. Uh, yeah, Dex. I think maybe got his camera angle slightly off. Sometimes that that can happen on those comeback routes, and and you're running at like the slightest of angle that the quarterback is not predicting, and then you don't recognize it before it happens, and the ball sails right over your shoulder. I'm pretty sure that's what just happened there. And unfortunately yeah. for the Mustangs, that's going to end that drive. Yeah, absolutely. If the Warriors capitalize on it, make it a two-possession game. Gooch rolls out, rolls to his left-hand side, rolls back, rolling around. He's got a lot of green in front of him, but he's going to get taken from the side by Katya. Katya, sorry. Yeah, Gooch is trying to do the exact same thing. That I mean, the, these two offenses, in my opinion, are are completely identical. Or, around the board, this is one of the most evenly skilled matchups in the entire it. league, to be honest. Like, it really is. So I, they just have to keep doing this. <laughs> it's good to watch. Absolutely, Gucci's got some got some room. Going to go and take up, take another three yards, third and five at the thirty-two. Yeah, good job by Staples there, stopping him for a, a short gain. Um, Gucci's not going to be upset with that at all. He wants to. He wants these third and five situations, yeah. third and four you situations, because he's going he's going to find someone underneath, and he knows yeah, he's going to. You so. just chop it up, get a couple up on a run, and then get a pass. Yeah, sure. You got to pass to run and run to pass. Yeah, this is the kind of running game that is is really good to see in second line. And this looking for one beautiful. block. There's one block, and he's going to go take it. the outside. Carl ran herself into it again. Down. Fumble, fumble, fumble. Oh, fumble. the fumble! And he goes out of bounds. I saw it go out of bounds. Yeah, that ball went out. That ball Pretty went sure that out ball of went out. bounds. We'll see how they play it. <laughs> she, uh, Veronica was able to pick it up before it actually registered out of bounds. But yeah, yeah it hit the white yeah, line. It, that severely. most definitely went out of bounds. Yeah, there was no doubt about that. Yeah, they're going to flip it. As they should. Good yep, call. There it goes. Well spotted by the referees. Yep. That is a good call. Yay, refs. <laughs> I hate on them as much as you want, but they're out here just giving their free time. and you know, We all get frustrated every once in a while, but keep your frustrations to yourself when it comes to referees, please. Like, just it's You might get frustrated. It's your game. It's the heat of the moment. We all understand that, but airing it out anywhere. We should, probably shouldn't do that. We are back it's on not Facebook. Nice. So why? Ha <laughs> why ha <laughs> it's not nice, guys. Oh, we're not, oh, yeah, like, are we going to get an explanation of what happened there? First-hand experience. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that for a second. How you gonna forget about that? Season one, bruh, <laughs> bruh. <laughs> Gooch takes the snap, rolls right, rolls back. Hashtag right, never forget. Green. He's looking around. He's got plenty of time in the backfield. There's a throw to the outside. Hits his right shoulder. Caught. Beautiful pass. Beautiful catch. He put that ball exactly, exactly where it needed to be. Playcock temporarily paused for a moment. Mustangs are looking for an explanation on the fumble. Oh, it went out of bounds. Yes, <laughs> it it um, went out of bounds. Like, it clearly out crossed out of bounds, and she picked it up uh, after it bounced back in. Like, I'm sure it's just Blaze. It, 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 okay. As, you know, Thank as you. the team leader, you gotta ask, I think, you know. I think you gotta... Yeah. It's just something I mean, you gotta ball, ask. When she grabbed the ball, the ball was already on the white. I mean, that's, yeah. that's the out-of-bounds... Down oh, set. Hits that, you pick it up, it's out of bounds. Gooch takes a snap, rolls to the left and set. I off is just kind of standing still, but he goes forward. He's got a block oh, on the wow. inside, got a block on the outside. Ooh. Good run. Very close to the first down. The pick up a 10. Yeah. Uh, this, again, 
there was only one v got there first forced him back in but then she got blocked yep. and then somebody stepped up from the middle that's it it's just one at a time it's just one at a time it's got to be multiple people you're not going to get gooch one-on-one Yep, good snaps, rolls right, looking for the run. He's kind of... Nice job by yard. Staples. Yep, Staples comes down and was able to uh, stop that really from going good. any further. That was, that, was a, that was a great job of the DE, actually. That That's going to be the unsung hero of that play. The DE was able Pushing to... Pushing him out. Was actually, no, actually, the DE had to pick up for Staples because Staples got blocked. And he picked up, held the outside contain. After Staples yeah. got away from the secondary block, he was able to come back in from the backside. Really good job by the gotcha. DE there. Oh, and he's going to go and push forward and get the first down. Yeah. It's too easy to get. You can't. You can't give him the first down. That's yeah. The, you gotta. You gotta. You can't give him that down first down run. You gotta block it to prevent that from happening. But go straight up the middle, right at the gut, first down. Down. Yeah, it's too downs. Easy. Gucci snaps, rolls right. There's the block up the middle. He's still he looking. Has, still mm. looking. Receivers are holding hands up. They seem. It's not good. Oh, there's another block to the outside for cat. He's got a guy wide open back left side. There he is. Marlo completely abandoned the sideline. Entirely abandoned. Sick. Yeah, you can't yeah. abandon that bat that bad. Even if you're even if your quarterback's on the other side of the field, you just can't give there, it up that hard. There are a few there are a few quarterbacks in this league that are good at finding people that get open like that. That's it. Troy, Cam, Crevin, and, and Gucci, I think, are probably the best for at just if someone gets open like that, they're not going to miss them. You you can't leave people open that way. Yep, a lot of the Mustangs, DEs, hanging around the line of scrimmage. Not much pass rush. There's a throw to the end zone. Yeah, I just checked it out, I think. Yeah. It's a little too deep. He's trying to sneak it in there. Not a bad decision. Either your guy gets it or nobody does. And that was no particular order for anybody. That might, that was I, that's just that was as they popped into my head. There's a handoff to the left hand side. Lito rolling out. Nope, to the you said Troy for us. Gonna get some. Oh, <laughs> no, per, nice no particular order. Six yards. So a, a handoff there, an unexpected handoff, caught him sleeping on the outside. Was able to get out. The play is. Yeah, under I said Troy first because a, 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 couple, a couple of times in our scrims, I've I've let it happen on my side. I know, and I, I have to be very mindful to not play as. The same way I might play against some of the other quarterbacks when we play against. Yeah, Shotguns. I mean, and you can <laughs> rotate over a little to the middle, but you can't just completely abandon. Yeah, it. you got to be yeah. able to come back over, but you got to leave enough where you can get back and and you know pick one of those balls. But mm -hmm. Gucci not afraid to throw cross field. Uh, to gonna be happy to just keep like just keeping it slow here, making sure they got everything going. Looks yeah, like so we, we got pause something play, though. Yeah, so pause there on the play. Not sure what happened. 36 seconds left in the third. This game is going absolutely blazing. Yeah, th it, there's been it's been a relatively clean game. There haven't been any penalties. Uh, there have been these stops, and like this stop has been the longest stop, obviously, in play. But there, you know, there haven't been any penalties. Very clean game, right, very so good game all around. The uh, chains are going to be moved back two yards. Oh, forward two yards. According to the relief well, referee, wait, just, uh, just another quick reminder: this game is brought to you by up two yards. By her so things, all... <laughs> she's a nice not person. Be unhappy. <laughs> yeah, not, I... not only is she a nice person and a, a great person to get to know. If you, if you, any she didn't you, actually step out. Just so I am her. I'm, she'd she probably be happy to I am anybody back. Just to feel the registry. Everybody, yeah. I am but she also right makes now. great mesh, obviously. <laughs> yeah, she does. I've got her. Uh, I've got her. Uh... Her yoga pants, they make my butt look fantastic. Sure, a homo. <laughs> You've got a pair too, Hef, don't lie. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> I'll let you log on my avatar and look at my inventory, <laughs> dog. I would be scared because I'm sure there are bajillions of outfits. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> takes his, exactly. He takes snap rolls right, quick screen pass out, but misses. Mm. Yeah, I don't know that that screen pass would have uh, yielded anything either. Uh, either way, Mikey Turbo was, uh, he saw, he read that all the way from the cornerback position over there. I'm not sure what happened. I thought Dex was playing out there. I guess maybe, I don't know if they're being switching off or whatever, but regardless, that Mikey was in really good position to, to defend yep. that really well. So, fourth and two situation, they're going to go good. ahead and yeah, take the field. I don't, I don't yep. disagree with this at all. Uh, nope, not one bit. Take the points in this yep. in this very close tight game. Take the points. You take them absolutely. Now, 
it's going to require getting the points and making it. But we're, we're, we've only let's hope he doesn't yards. miss this one. Down. Eight yards, 100% kick. 100%. And it's a 17-7. So making it a, a, you know, close to a two-possession game now. It's with good. the uh, with the Mustangs now trailing, so they're gonna no, have to play catch up. It's two up. possession. It's still they still have to score in some form or fashion at least twice. Yep, yep, they, yep. You're right. Two possessions in. I know. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> this is common. <laughs> I'm gonna go play Fallout. Screw you guys. I'm going. <laughs> I just haven't played going anywhere, bro. Today. We got a game, dog. Oh yeah, we got. One Speaking of, those of which, y'all stick around. Make sure y'all get your tickets. If you don't have tickets, where you play next? Be a Fun game to play. It'll be the Bulldogs against the Buccaneers. Be my, be my first game. We'll be welcoming Matt and Tom back home. They left off. They left us for a little bit, but uh, they know they, they knew they had to come back to good old Hefe. They couldn't <laughs> live without me. Well, it's your outfit Damn. decision making, you know? bruh. I'm on point. We <laughs> we on fleek, son. <laughs> There's a kick, and it's gonna go past both of them and bounce out the back of the end zone, as we discussed. Uni's on fleek. Option. You're never gonna see us looking like some booty. <laughs> I can't be handling that. If we're gonna be, if we're playing Barbie doll simulator, and like, let's just play Barbie doll simulator real quick. You feel me? I feel you. <laughs> That's terrible. Down. <laughs> Play snaps rolling to his left hand side. Not a block there. V wow. It, Not a block to be had, open. but it doesn't matter. Yep. Get out of bounds, boys. Good job. Oh, he, he didn't. Tackled? No, he got tackled. He could have saved himself. Se I mean, four seconds. You think that's not a lot? Four or five seconds that he had when he got actually. I think it was seven seconds to be fair when he got tackled. Um, but that's seven seconds you might need later in this close game. Absolutely down. Blaze takes ah, takes a snap. Oh, Darian comes in. Darian, and wow, obliterates him. We're gonna need. He is coming free field. off that side entirely too often. Yeah, but but what my thing, Billy, is that that's a hundred percent on Blaze. Like Blaze had the vision to see it. Like that guard had no idea that Blaze probably was about to run through that gap. Like that's Blaze's vision. Like that's Down. nine times out of ten when you watch the Mustangs, that's how he gets blocks. He actually runs his blocker, his the defenders into his blockers. His blockers don't actually get blocks. Not to be mean, but and he's that's got just a the way it is. He's got it over the top. Ooh, nice, mm. fantastic catch there by Dre. And the uh, the Mustangs marching it up the field to answer back. Eight minutes, nine seconds to go. I can finally yeah. say it now. In the game. Get a timeout. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to call the game over on the first quarter. Oh, play was stopped. Uh-oh. Timeout, Mustangs. Yeah, they okay. called timeout. Okay, okay. <laughs> Maybe, did, are they TPing somebody? I don't they have know a crash if that player. would be worth a timeout unless they were. Somebody crashed. Uh, it was at Staples. Okay. Yeah, it looks you, like it was Staples that was crashed over there. So that's really unfortunate, um, having to burn a timeout. But obviously, a player like I don't know what he's doing. Really he kind of crashed, but now he's running. Oh yeah, he's off the home, the corner. Apparently. <laughs> Gamed in on him, watching him run. Run. <laughs> and he's still a running. And look at him go. Where are you going, son? The field is this way. <laughs> Yeah, one to two PM in. I mean, and they've got the full two minutes. Staples is already logging back online, so it looks like they're gonna get him probably back in before the even play even starts. Luckily, he did not TP back on, or log back into the field after crashing. Yeah, we're gonna TP him in. He didn't get the TP though, so hold on, me move over here. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, hungry. I thought you were going to go eat at halftime, dog. Well, halftime was, well, I we did ads and I had to re-log and, yeah, I didn't have time. Whatever. I didn't have time. Cause I gotta, I'm making, I'm gonna turn my my regular spaghetti sauce. I'm gonna put some spices in it to make it spicy spaghetti for tonight. My, my good luck. Shut spaghetti. up. <laughs> Welcome back from your run, sir. I'm gonna need you to detach your helmet. Uh, 
process. Alrighty, and the ball is in play. Down. And it looks like they don't have him back, so Blaze takes a snap, rolls to the right hand side. Darian almost He's got the edge in, if he wants Gabe, it. Yep. yep. He over pursued on that one, gave Blaze all the outside he needed. Good job by Blaze. Step over. That'll be a first down. <laughs> Blue is clearly over the yellow. Give him a nice little first. Good run by Blaze. Good take. Uh, unfortunately, Darian trying to go for another one of those with real big quick sacks. Blaze was ready for it, though. Just made a nice little move, got outside. And unfortunately, yep. there goes bit the of edge. pursuing there. Yep. I know that one. Trips left. Hasn't really deviated from Down. the formation at all this game. Blaze snaps, rolls to the left-hand side. Got a good block. He's got plenty of room. Smoke coming in. Gooch. Oh, guts to the middle. And a nice little in outside cut and finally gets tackled. A beautiful run there. Pickup of nine yards. 740. Doesn't that. 740 to go. And it looks like Scotty is... Yeah, I completely missed that play, I won't lie. I'm, <clears throat> I may or may not have entirely spaced out looking at something on the internet, sorry. <laughs> Off of fortune. For, re for, re for reasons undisclosed. <laughs> this is a little... I was paying Down. attention to other things. Yo, share, dog. There's a snap roll to the right-hand side. He's, he's, got the, he's got the touch on right there. There it is, boom. Yep. Nice route. Unfortunately for the Mustangs, uh, the cornerback gave up the edge and that you can't every quarterback in the league hits that pass every oh, yeah. quarterback in the league hits that pass 10 out of 10 times that's a 15 yard what is that 15 yard straightforward throw yep yeah if you uh, give it money. up if you give it up it's over on that one down set hike there's the kick it's up it's good 14 17 it's good most things staying in this one i like Absolutely. it bill i like it they did what they needed to do Blaze ran it when he needed to. Do. He got one big hit over the top and then just, you know, took his time and got it into the end zone. Well now done. for the Mustangs to take this, they're going to have to stop the Warriors on this one and get the ball back. Keep the Warriors from getting downfield and getting another field goal or a touchdown. And then the Interesting Mustangs will definitely note, do that. Interesting note, Gucci's trying to pull a fast one on Blaze. He, he looked at which way Blaze was pointing, like facing to kick, and he's actually on that that far side ball. Hoping he can grab it actually this time. Hmm. We'll see if Blaze is trying to is trying to do what Toroff does and tries to pull some ridiculous fake out that ends up going out of bounds. Down <laughs> set hike. We won't talk about Tor and his kicking when his missed field goals. <laughs> <laughs> Only Gooch. a ninety-five percent from Blaze and Gooch, Gooch has it. Gooch rolling left, rolling up, nice. And there cuts. Gooch goes. Beautiful cuts. And, and there Katya Gooch goes. Cuts to the inside and and gives up the line. And Gooch is going to continue going and finally tackled by Katya. Told you, you cannot kick the ball to that guy. <laughs> you can't let him have it. See, when I was kicking, I was camming down. I was going into mouse look, looking who was down there every single time. I'm like, nope, yep. I'm not giving it to you. Mm -mm. That, was a, that was a good job by the Mustangs to, to try to get themselves a, a favorable situation. And unfortunately for the Mustangs, they didn't see the switch there. Obviously, I saw it. The old switcheroo. I pay attention, I, I pay attention to these things. You can't pull a fast one on me, Mr. Gucci. I see you. <laughs> but you did there. Say again, Russ. Man, man, I'm good. Okay, both teams just re register. Wow. <laughs> oh. It's alright. I've been singing a Fallout version of uh, Hotline Bling, I think. It's like, you used to call me on the Pit Boy. Yeah. I know. I can see the glare through TeamSpeak right now, Hef. I don't doubt it. <laughs> I can feel it. You're giving me the look like... Oh, sick. There's a snap. Double shotgun formation rolling to the left-hand side. It's gonna be a run. He crosses the line of scrimmage. Movement up. Marlo comes down from the CB spot and stops Gucci from picking up any extra. But he does pick up five yards, second and five. So a fantastic first run. Lining back up in the running back formation. Snap roll into his right. 
He's looking around, gonna get another hole, gonna move up, move oh, up. Oh, he a just made juice. me look ankles, silly. Oh my gosh. Ankles, ankles destroyed. Dull. Nice move by Gucci. We're gonna need some ankle replacements on the field. <sighs> Gotta make that. Gotta make that tackle. Go. Yeah. Gucci snaps, rolls to the left-hand side, going up to the line of scrimmage. Veronica's get blocked on the outside. Katya gets blocked. He's going to continue mm. moving up, and another first down. It's too easy. Warriors. Way yeah. too easy. Easily in in field goal for uh, field goal range now. Uh, if they do choose to kick, that'll get them up another three, which will have a six-point lead. Down. Pretty sure they're looking to get into the end zone, though. We've got plenty of time. Gucci takes a snap, rolls to his right-hand side. Looking around, waiting to get some blocks. He's got the middle Dropping if he back. wants. Oh, never mind. It's covered up now. Oh, he's got the corner. Yep, he's gonna go to it. Oh, oh, nice. Oh, wow. Nice, nice yeah. save there. By he threw it like he Jesus. he had to throw it right then. He had to throw it right then, or if yeah, he threw that any later, right that gets picked. That was a nice read. He was jumping the hell out of that Almost interception, oh, but man. I was it, already ready yeah. to call it interception. Yeah, it was <laughs> open right then, and he threw it right then, and it just got right by him. That was a, that was a nice play by Gooch. Nice catch there as well. I saw the I saw the white jersey jump the route and I thought it was over. Yeah, saw him, I saw him sprinting down at it, but yep, I took the breath just, to call get, it. He but, couldn't reach it. I mean, just I think any other quarterback other than the, the top quarterback would have made that throw. It had been picked all day long, but Gucci just was able to just to drop that dime where it needed yeah, to be. That was a very good pass. And the blade, the blade is in Paul. Wow, the pl down. The kick is up. It's good. I'm not even gonna try and continue. <laughs> Warriors twenty four, Mustangs fourteen. Five minutes, nineteen seconds to go in the game. Spreading it back out to a two possession league. Lead. It's good. Not league. It's really unfortunate for the Mustangs. They. Mm, this this is they've they got to score right now they have to score on this possession and they have to score quick Dick aiming to his left hand side to the Mustang's right looks like he's aiming towards Kent Voss down <laughs> there's the kick gonna bounce into the hands of Kent Voss he's gonna bring it out bring it into the middle and get tackled they're going to take over at the 30-yard line. And you're right. The the Mustangs absolutely have to get up quickly and score if they're going to want to save this game. I And I you know, I would be pressed to say get up, score, down, onsides, kick it, and then uh, try just try and get the ball back. Blaze takes the snap, rolls to his left-hand side. Darian Humphreys on the chase on the outside, keeping Blaze pinned towards the end zone. Smoke coming in. Oh, he chuck, wow. just chucks it up. It's a three on one. It three on one, and he wins it. Yeah, that was sick. That of was a beautiful catch by sick. Coming up big for the Mustangs. You mean the Warriors? The Warriors. Excuse me. Unfortunate <laughs> for the Mustangs. <laughs> there you go. You forgot a couple words there. Yeah. That's probably game. I feel like it Down is. Got plenty Unless of time they get like a pick six. The clock. Yeah, they got plenty of time to control the clock. Uh, I mean, that looks like he's what he's going to try to do. He's just going to try and keep it on the ground. Break some yeah, more he's ankles. He's not throwing but... the ball. He's an, he's an intelligent guy. He knows football. He knows how to win. He's not going to throw a pass that isn't wide open. He's going to run it until fourth, until third down. And then if he has to throw it, he'll throw it. I mean, one of the best games that I've seen all season long. I, I've, it's been a very, very hard fought game between both teams. And it wasn't until that pick right there that we knew that the game was pretty much sealed, but it still could go either way. Hey, he's just going to eat all the clock down. Five seconds to go. Down. Down. Sit. There's Smart. a snap. Yep, rolling to the right hand side. Oh, good job of, by the Warriors. Yeah, I mean, by great, the great little block there, but he did get yeah. closed down. Yeah, the, well, Mustangs did a good job. Of the defensive linemen on the backside they scraped right down and they stopped him for a, for a 
relatively short game, so uh, Gooch is probably going to be forced to throw it here as he comes out in the five wide set. So looking probably to throw here. So good job by the Mustangs. They're going to save themselves some time because of that nice play. Absolutely. Down set. Forced him out of bounds, actually. Rolls to the left hand so side. That was actually amazing. Oh, Darian didn't. Oh, he didn't have the angle. So many times, so many times, uh, receivers will not um, keep the quarterback in the middle of your screen. And just some free inform. Just if you guys want it, here you go. Receivers, when you're when you're running those short crossing routes like that, or you're running those slant routes on the inside. You must keep your quarterback in the center of your screen. If you don't, you'll get an awkward angle on the ball, and you will miss it every time, every single time. You have to keep the quarterback in the middle of your screen can't let that happen if you get if you let him get behind you or you get in front of him and you mess that angle up it's very very i'm not saying that you're gonna 100 percent miss it because it is obviously you can still make a great catch uh but it's very very hard absolutely fourth down they're gonna go ahead and punt it away in a play of game I'm not sure what's going on right now. That's it. All right, well, they're just going to play it. They must have had something going on with the refs. I don't know. Yeah. Decent return there. Decent return. Mustangs will be happy with this field position. Um, they, they, Their defense stepped up. Right when they needed them to, they they have a shot in this game still. That was a great, um, great defensive getting, series for the Mustangs. Is there no penalty and, for delay um, of game? Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna you know be paid off with this opportunity to to get back down the field. Still, still game game is still in, in reach for them. All right, and the game was uh, temporarily uh, paused right now. Mustangs are looking for a uh, delay game call. It should call. be a delay game. Gooch lagged out at the, as the time clock ran out, so it's a delay game. It should be. Yeah, I um I would ask for it too because yeah, you're gonna get it. You're gonna back them up five yards. Yeah, see, I, I was confused as to you know what had, what was going on with that. <laughs> you know, good. Tom, you mentioned it, and you know we're si all kind of sitting here waiting for it to be assessed, and there was no assessment. So, uh, <laughs> so yeah, Mustangs, good job there. Uh, by Blaze, I'm assuming it was Blaze that spoke up and made sure that the you know every you know these guys might miss something every once in a while. So he just you know said, hey, you know, did you guys miss? They they had to delay a game there. Referees were like, oh yeah, we did, and yeah. we Oops. got it fixed. We, yeah, we got it <laughs> fixed, and the Mustangs are going to be granted with probably better field field position for it. And if I'm uh, Gucci. I'm kicking that ball right back to Dre. <laughs> yeah. All right. Hold on. Refs, the ball should be on. Hey, there's, there's no way I'm kicking this ball on a... to Blaze. He's aiming at Blaze right now, which is worrisome for me. Like I'm, I'm, thinking, I'm like, I'm trying to be like, okay, I'm trying to fake him out. Like, I really hope so because you, you have no business kicking this ball to Blaze. I would not kick to Blaze. I'd kick it far away from Blaze if I could. So let's go at odd. I am Pushing not going to spot the ball. Okay, yeah. See, gotcha. I was I was wondering because they're like ten yards back oh, right now from the, and I I didn't think that they were that far back. No, one second. Yeah, we'll take a moment here to uh, kind of acknowledge some positions that are needing field. Uh, field. Wow, field. If you are looking to commentate, you get in touch with myself, Tom Box. Uh, Matt Asadar or Psych Troglodyte if you want to come in and con commentate or stream. And if you're looking to ref, get in touch with Razden McAndrews. Raz09 is going to be his, uh, his display name in Second Life.
Uh, so for those on the sim, actually, that were uh, unable to hear uh, the, the explanation, um, it, right now the Damn, Warriors shit. are contesting uh, the spot of the ball. So it looks like there they the kick. didn't win their contestation. So here we go. Kick to Dre, and he's going to dance around and get tackled at about the 42. Yeah, good job. Kick that ball to Dre. It's intelligent play by Gooch. So my, my worries were for not... Mustang's going to take over, though. Better field position than before, so good job to speak up and make sure that the referees got it right. Down. Line up trips right. There's a snap rolling to his right-hand side. Darian Humphrey's coming in, but Blaze, oh, you can't run this Blaze ball. Blaze goes up and actually runs into uh, Zach Locke. There can't run this ball right now. He would have got a couple more yards, but he actually ran into one of his linemen. He had Dre over the middle, it looked like, too. I think he could have made that pass. I don't think Sick was in a uh, position to defend it had Down. he thrown it on his inside shoulder. That rolls to the left-hand side. He's got the middle open right now. Far back to there it is. The comeback route. Dre coming back. He's going to look around, get stumbled, mm -hmm. and tackled. Good job keeping him in bounds. Unfortunate on the yardage, but that's not terrible for the Warriors right now. They're not terribly worried about even giving up a touchdown. They don't want to, but they're not insanely worried about it at the moment. They just want to keep that clock going. Down. Good job. He, yeah, he just he was able to just. He's got no. He, he's got nowhere to go. His line is not his. His line is not setting the edge. They're not getting on the outside of the outside linebacker outside linebackers that are rushing and he's having to force himself back into the middle of the field and that means he can't throw the ball because there's nowhere to go with it absolutely they did a good job in setting the edge there he's got a lot of room to work with he's going to go and run it get the first down and then some and then's going to go ahead and step out of bounds that, that's all you got to do blaze. for a guy like blaze that's that's all you've got to do you can set that edge the play is pretty much over because he's going to force either a one of your coverage guys to come down to stop his run and he could possibly just pull up and throw it at that point or 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 b you're you're having to just completely give up Bounce, like, the rush set, or hike. completely yeah completely abandon the rush and drop more people into coverage and then he's still gonna run so yep, blaze like, snaps rolling far back there's a throw and a man on a comeback but it's ooh. gonna be a little short on dre yeah dre like the la that last step he took he took a step towards the middle i don't know if that would have mattered i'm not sure if he actually could have still reached it or not but it would have been a lot closer if he didn't give that little inside step down blaze snaps rolls to the left hand side dropping back veronica with a block gonna continue rolling out there's a throw short but oh hoo -hoo, gooch almost mm. picked that off mm -mm -mm. that's a dangerous pass Dangerous pass, but doesn't matter. It falls incomplete, so just reset. Try to get another look. Down. Play snaps, rolls left, going back right. He's got a man on the comeback on the right side. He's going to throw to the mm, middle. Why did he throw to the middle? Why? Mm. Why? He had the comeback on the outside. You catch it, you get I'm the out. same yardage, and you get out of bounds, but he forces the ball into the middle. <laughs> uh, I don't like that decision. It was a dangerous yeah, they're going to burn a timeout. They're going to burn a timeout. Yeah, like it was, it was a free throw to the outside, completely free. There was nobody there. You miss it, it falls incomplete. You miss that throw, it gets picked. Like there, there, There's zero reason to throw that pass. I, maybe he just didn't see it. I don't know. That's really unfortunate, though. Forces a timeout. We're ready. And do we have a pause? Oh, there we go. Timeout. Ball is in play now. Blaze snaps, rolls to the left-hand side. Gucci's is coming down, makes Blaze go to the right. He's looking. Really There's good coverage. Oh, he's side. got the backside. There. And caught for a touchdown. That actually was a saving catch. Uh, yeah. I think it was Dex out there completely the misread Andre the Mew. ball. Dre did. Was that Dre that caught that? Yep, that was Dre. Yeah, that was a great job by Trey to just to go to – even though the ball wasn't initially for him, I don't believe, he just went up there and got it. Uh, so good job by him to be aware enough to, you know, don't just let a ball go just because it's not intended for you. If you got a shot at it, take your shot at it. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, soon on tonight's kick, hopefully. That would be awesome. Down, set, hike. Oh, I want. Oh, I I don't even care if it's against us. On it, I just want somebody to actually get one. Like it would be so cool. Like I wish somebody would figure out how to how to actually do it with this ball. It'd be so dope. Point is good. Twenty four to twenty one. A very, very, very close tight game. One minute twenty five left. The uh, the Mustangs are going to have to kick an onside kick. Um, I mean, if you turn the ball over to the to the Warriors, all they got to do is just stall for two player for three plays, and it's over. Yeah. Minute twenty. They, on, honestly, what the war? If I well, what I would do is I would just snap the ball as Gooch and just dance around on the backfield, make him come get him. Yep. Good luck. Come get me. Come tackle me. Don't even throw the ball. Just stand there. And then even if you have to on fourth down, literally just run to the back of the end zone, take a safety to end the game. <laughs> I'm I'm cammed in on the meter, watching the meter. Down, set. 30%. It's all yeah, about kick, but, he, but he's going to kick it directly <clears throat> to the Warriors. So, it's so hard to do on this ball. Like, you really got to kick you it can't, off can't, to the Yeah, side. Like, you, you can't. Like, it's like the thing about onside kicks is like they're hard enough, especially when the defense, especially like when the receiving team knows it's coming, like yeah. even in real life. like. But even when you catch people off guard, like in SL, like, there's no like closing speed, you know. It's not like yeah, everybody's the same speed. It's all com there's no skill to it, so it's so hard for it to like, you know, matter with the way that the ball works. Like you can't like really put skill into it. I don't think it's interesting. I hope somebody can figure it out though. It'd be so cool to start seeing onside picks well, switch I mean, things up a I've, bit. I've had one successful, and basically what it was done is I just kicked it hard to the towards the sideline right at about 10 yards and my outside the furthest guy to the outside was able to cut in and grab it right at the 10 yard mark yeah all right and yep that's the kneeling yep. formation yep. i'm seeing yeah see i don't i don't like the kneel but it's fine doesn't really matter ultimately because the believe... mustangs have what one timeout yep yeah they've got one timeout so they're not gonna be able to stop the clock anyway after the first player. That was it. <laughs> he and actually it's, gets it's tackled. A, it's a kneel. Yeah. He actually, no, he actually got tackled. Rest of clock should still be running. <laughs> so Staples is going to pick up the little stat there. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't get, you should be able to get tackled on a, on a kneel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that makes me smile. <laughs> oh, they're going to move it back up, though. Yeah. Fields is third and ten. It's not right, right? Shouldn't it be second down? No, it should be third no, and eleven. No, it should be... Because you... you... You, you you when you kneel you essentially lose a yard like every time you do it. Right. So it you know, should be theory. second and eleven. Yeah it, yeah, it should be second and eleven. I'm not sure. That, yeah, it's it, that's the yeah. They don't, I don't think they the ones we have today really watch football much. So they probably wouldn't know that. It's fine. It, it's not that big of a deal ultimately. It doesn't matter. So it looks that like the it. Warriors are actually just gonna elect to go, to start going for it. I guess. Yeah, he's just gonna run it around. Yeah, that's what I would have done anyway. I'm out. I don't like kneeling. 42 on the playcock, 41, 40. So they're going to have one second, basically. Oh, and play was stopped. Like, Probably it makes sense. Out. Like, kneeling totally makes sense, like, in real life. Like, because there's no reason to, like, risk any more of your players on any, you know, on two uh, or three plays. There's zero out. point in doing that. Like, but I did. it's not like That's you can get injured in SL. Like, just go. Who cares? Like, <laughs> yeah, you might fumble it, but whatever. I think it's more fun. I'm out, Mustang. Yeah, I'm That's just me, though. Time out from the uh, from the Mustangs, and uh, stay tuned after the game. We're gonna go in immediately into some ads, and then we'll we'll talk about the game, and then uh, go ahead and close it. And Hef and I gotta go out and uh, we'll get ready for our game. <laughs> and then we'll, then we gotta talk about player of the game. Must, Mustangs hmm. are ready. Uh, it's an extreme tough one. Um,
I mean, Sick has been has been the man of the game. I feel, and that's Sick is going to get my vote. But I mean, hmm. Gooch has been really passing. Yeah, but, but well. who yeah. I like, who I like, and and I'll and I'll tell you why I like him. I like Darian in this game, and and this is why. The the to beat the Mustangs, we said that you would have to do one thing, and that was control Blaze. Darian pretty much shut down that side for of. of Nine, you know, so many times when when Blaze snapped the ball and went to go right, Darian was right in his face, and they would completely shut the play down. That's my vote. That's what you I know. Vote. I and, and, you know, thinking about it, it, you know, I always try to uh, put my vote on if if you take that single oh, individual sick. out, would the game have been drastically different? And oh, tackled and sacked by Veronica. Good tackle. That is good game. Must the, the game. Um, with Darian. Good if game, Mustangs. Darian good luck out, for the rest I of the season. He would have had a lot, a lot less, you know, pressure on that outside. He came in, kept Blaze under control. Uh, Agreed. And, and definitely did exactly what he needed to do. So, congrats to Darian Humphreys, player of the game for this game, and congratulations. Uh, you know, congrats to the Warriors, but I mean, the Mustangs did put up a good fight as well. So, you know, excellent game on both sides. This has been. The Pulse Game of the Week Warriors versus the Mustangs. Final score, 24 for the Warriors, Mustangs 21. And let's go ahead and knock out a few ads. Yeah, we can do that. You uh, Go ahead and arrange that while I do ads. LTD loves to decorate as a bi-monthly home and garden magazine, a monthly event. And of course, the LTD website where you can get all information relating to home and garden. We are the number one resource for home and gardening. We showcase all amazing home and garden talents, and such such as designers, photographers, and stylists. LTD is an Abbey Choice winner for the best home and garden website. Vinyl. Vinyl is inspired by a messy combination of hipster classic rock, whimsical imaginings with a dash of geek mixed in. You'll find high-quality, 100% handmade original mesh clothing and accessories for men, women, and unisex. Logolepsy. Logolepsy is a fascination or obsession with words. Logolepsy is bringing your favorite quotes and song lyrics to Second Life in a new artistic way. Logolepsy also makes posters, flyers, and invitations for your next big event. VR Sporting Goods. From custom gloves to standard gloves, face paints, and more, VR Sporting Goods has football gear for your next big game in the UFL. And that is going to wrap up the post-game advertisements for this game. I do believe we're going to try and get Darian over for a, a quick little interview, uh, chit-chat with him for a moment about the game. And once again, uh, congratulations to both sides. I want to thank everybody for showing up, all the fans on the fan side, all the fans in the Hitbox world. We really thank you, and we uh, big thanks to the staff as well. We could not be doing it uh, without you guys. And for those listening to my voice, if we could uh, get open access so we can interview Darian, please. Thank you. Crickets. Thank you once again for opening access. All right, yes, so thank you. let me stand up and come over there. Actually, Darian, oh. congratulations, my friend. Uh, Tom and I both felt that your um, presence from the outside linebacking position to uh, be able to pretty much shut down that side for the most part of the game for Blaze, we felt like um, was uh, worthy of nominating you and awarding you the player of the game. Uh, so congratulations, sir. And I'm going to go ahead and let Tom go ahead and, and, and open up if he has a, a, an initial question for you. Um, you know, no, no real, real initial, initial like, like you know, super, super questions, questions to ask. But just, but, just, you know, what you did know, you come into the game? game? You know, what was your kind of mindset coming in there? Did you did you come in with the 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 B line for just shutting Blaze down, or, or did you just kind of, you know, what was the mindset coming in? Um, I'm sorry, I just got voice back. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> TL, TLDR, congratulations. You won player of the game because you were a beast from LLB. There we go. Tom, first question. First question is, did you did you come into, into this, this game uh, with, with a certain, certain specific game, game plan? Disconnected. Um, you, know, you know, going after Blaze in the way that you did. Um, yeah, absolutely. First of all, um, let me congratulate the Mustangs, man. That was that was a dogfight right up to the end. Um, 
great squad. Looking forward to uh, seeing what they do the rest of the season. Um, yeah, our game plan, we knew that we had to get pressure on Blaze. Um, yeah, we knew that if we gave him enough time, uh, he's got too many weapons on offense, uh, you know, and, and can really burn you if, if you give him enough time. So um, our game plan going into it was to, you know, try to contain him, but at the same time put enough pressure on him to make him force some throws and, and you know, keep it on his feet. We felt that if, if we could keep him on his feet, you know, you know, I, I think, Cafe, you said it one time, you know, Blaze is going to get his yards, but, you know, yeah. we'd rather him gain 10 or 15 than, than pass for 50. And uh, and run the score up on us. So exactly. yeah, that was pretty much our game plan. Yeah, okay, that's okay. kind of what I figured. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of what I figured. So um, the only thing that I that I have to to ask is is did you guys? So a lot there are there are times, and if if everybody in this league and, and if everyone is honest with themselves, sometimes you're going into a game, and you're like, man, I really don't know if we can win this game. You know what I mean? Like, was that ever a thought, or, or were you guys just a hundred percent like, "Yo, we got this"? Because we, because from our, on our point of view, I, I actually had picked you guys to win, but I knew it was going to be a really close game, and, and I was just wondering if that played, you know, anything at all. And so, yeah, you know, your, your game plan. Absolutely, we, you know, we knew going into this, um, you know, the Mustangs are they're just they've got so many high caliber players over there that if you sleep on them for a second, they're going to eat you up, and. Uh, you know, we knew that um, we felt confident in our game plan. We felt confident that we would, you know, be able to come away with the win. But at no point did any of us say, you know, hey, you know, we got this and let's look forward. Who do we play right, next? Right. No, it was um, – we knew that, that this was a must win for us in our in our conference. Um, you know, there was a little bit of pride on the line too. You know, we felt that, uh, <laughs> you know – you know, you know, Mustangs, rightfully so. You know, there's been a lot of talk about them and, and a lot of yep, expectations yep. from them. And and you know, in our locker room, man, we we see ourselves as as at that level too. So you know, we didn't have absolutely to tonight, but, but um, at no point did we say, oh, oh we got this. Um, I, honestly, all day I've had knots in my stomach waiting for this game. To to be honest. <laughs> That's, that's that's good to hear. Yeah, that's kind of what I figure. Yeah, it's and that's you know it was good to see you guys see you guys come out here and execute your game plan. Unless, unless Tom has anything else, that that's all I've got, man. I just want to say congratulations again. Thanks a lot. Yeah, no, guys. You, I pretty much it. the same thing. I mean, just you know, fantastic game. So congrats on uh, on pretty much beast moding it out there. I mean, I there was some <laughs> of the hits I, I saw out there just made me cringe. And you know, <laughs> the medics on the field after one of those smacks. But uh, yeah, congratulations, great game, and uh, congratulations on player of the game. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Okay. I have a good one. All right, we gotta go. So on stream, thanks guys for watching. Y'all have a good rest of y'all's day. Okay, we gotta go. Bye. <laughs> yep, my name is Tom Box. He is Hefe, and uh, got riding on camera. Thank you guys so much once again. Thanks to all the staff.